here today to talk about the first e-prescription provided in the Greater Hunter region. It's an exciting announcement for patient choice. Being able to access prescriptions by uh, telehealth through their general practitioner uh, while they're still at home or they may be housebound, the doctor is able to send that prescription via SMS or email to the patient and the patient can then choose how they on send that to their pharmacy. This doesn't replace a traditional GP consultation or that face-to-face -face interaction where the patient is provided that same choice of being able to receive an SMS or email or in fact still continuing with a traditional script that is a paper-based copy that can then be provided to the pharmacy. E-scripting will reduce some of the, the administrative burden on GPs, um, which then frees up time for them to be focusing again on the patient and again on, on the service that we're offering. But it also means that there's greater collaboration between the pharmacist and the GP, which is always good. We're working as a team to help the patient. So I think electronic prescriptions are really good. Um, they make it a lot easier for the patient, the doctor and the pharmacy um, just to generally manage scripts. It means that you're going to have less lost scripts um, and less administrative burden in general. And they can then either bring that into the pharmacy for scanning or forward that through to the pharmacy. Um, once we have that, we scan it, it's really easy and we just process it as per normal script. The patient then has the choice of being able to either pick up that prescription and be notified, or in fact, uh, have that home delivered. Like, look, it was just so easy. Um, I got the text from the doctor with my script on it. Um, it was just a matter of sending that through to the chemist and it was delivered here to the door. It was just fantastic. We're really encouraging people and pharmacists and surgeries to um, register their interest and to get on board and contact their local PHN.